la la la. Are we back? Are we back? Have we returned? Well, that's what happened. La la la. la, la, la. Okay, so that does work now, actually. Oh my god. How's, how's it going, everybody? We're, we're back. Um... Sorry. <laughs> anyway, I mean, <laughs> uh, we might have some Zelda hype. Anyway, <laughs> yeah, we get some alpaca rages in the chat. Um, well, I don't know how far I got into that, but either way, uh, hold on. We're going to make it really creepy with an echo. Barracuda! And then it broke. Barracuda. Welcome, Welcome to the, the patrol. patrol. Thank, Thank you, you for, for subscribing. It goes a long way in supporting what we do and make a Bible thing we're going to do. So that new beat, stick, and cape. It's, it's very confusing. It's like a speech jammer trying to talk with this thing on the listening listen town. town. I wonder, I wonder can, can I do, I do this? this? Oh, I can. So now I'm just like talking with the... There's no echo. Why is the echo off? It's actually not that good. It's not even like doing anything. Anyway, uh, <laughs> Barracuda, welcome to the patrol. Thank you very much. How's it going? What I did is I turned off the mic, and then I, it's all left, is it all left here, too? I don't know what happened. Morphox just, like, broke. Like, it wasn't using my, um, it wasn't using my, my microphone. It just switched to a different one. And that's then, a lot of oh nuts. my god, that's a lot of nuts! That's a lot sure, of nuts. I don't know why Twitch is doing that, but either way, Shored, welcome to the patrol. Thank you for subscribing. It goes a long way in supporting what I do and making it a viable thing for me to do. So don your new cape and your beat stick, and we will stalk the night in search of llamas and loiters and strike fear into their hearts. Shored, get into this patrol. Thank you for subscribing. Oh, it's wonderful. I don't know why it's doubling. It's weird. Can we get some alpaca patrol badges in the chat? Elucidator, only one who did it. You bastards. Either way, sure ad. Welcome on in here, buddy. Thank you for thank you for the sub, my friend. So the new So Freeze told me about a new team meet game that was going to be announced uh at PAX during the stream. Was that Super Meat Boy Forever? Or... No, I, I did see the Isaac Rebirth pack stream. It was pretty cool. It was weird, because it was like... I've watched Man vs. Game play Isaac before, and, uh... He's... he's he, I mean, he's, he's a reasonably good player. Like, he... he you know, he's, he, he's not a bad player. But he looked awful in that... On that stream. Maybe it was nerves. It might have been nerves. But is it Super Meat Boy Forever? Yeah, so Super Meat Boy Forever... Th this was... They, they wanted to make a Meat Boy for iOS. No one remembered that, and I told everybody. Nick said I was bullshitting. Uh, but yeah, they, I guess I guess that's their game. I didn't read about it, but I... Super Meat Boy Forever, is that... Is it iOS like an Infinite Runner Meat Boy? Is that what it is? Oh, hey, Maul. Oh, Maul, uh... You can get into the call. Let me, uh... Let me call her up. Boop, boop. Boop, boop. Uh, Team Feet. That'd be weird. Greeting Sir Robert the Third. How art thou, liege? Hey, Alice in Sushiville. Hey, Mal. Hi. How's it going? Yeah, so Elucidator, uh, Freeze actually worked that out during the stream last time. Which is, uh, interesting. Um... I didn't hear any of what you just said. I'm sorry. I just said that your mom suckled on my dongle. Don't say stuff like that about my mother, please. <laughs> I mean, what, hey, you can't tell the truth. I want to close that. That's she hasn't even been. Whatever. <laughs> How's it going? Uh, She's been busy getting ready for my niece's baptism. You sick fuck. That's how she gets ready. I mean, what? That's so <laughs> wrong about sick that. Fuck. There's nothing wrong with that. Oh, I'm in a glass case of motion. There is like a, 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 a outpour of support today. Thank you, everybody. I'm in a glass case of motion. That emotion is gratitude. A $30 donation from Proud Fob. $30. I really enjoy your content, and this is the only way to show my appreciation. Thank you, Proud Fob. Thank you very much. 
That is wonderful. Thank you for the support, sir. I wish that my... I, I gotta fix the Morphox Pro, and I would give you the, the loud, echoey, booming Rob that you so deserve. Thank you for the $30 donation. Thank you for the support, sir. That is that is wonderful. I'd like to boom some Rob, please. Wow. Also, the last time I got $30 was, like, middle school. Uh, from my parents. Excuse and they me. they would just hand I, you 20 bucks. I bought you $30 worth of pizza the other day. Oh, yeah, you did. I love you. <laughs> <laughs> last time I got $30. <laughs> I mean, like... Thirty dollars I can hold in my hand. Oh, I see. So the pizza is not enough to hold in your hand. <laughs> I mean, wait a minute, L Rob. Maybe I should. <laughs> Why did Mal just I blow didn't... her nose on stream? Did she? Did you... I didn't. Oh my god. Mal, why do? You... What? What is that sound? It sounds like a fucking idiot is talking. Who is that? I'm just kidding. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm just fucking idiot. Uh, we'd rather have Rob blow his load. I don't know about that. Uh, thank you seriously though, Proud Fob. Uh, you know what I, you know what I want to do is I wrote. Oh God. Uh, hey, Marleybot's around. So there's, by the way, Spasm. No, spasm no. made a game. Show me. Sorry, um, I'm done. So that's the. Uh, oh, that's actually like a bad link. You just go to spaz uh, alpaca dungeon .com. Anyway, uh, Bear sent me. It's your first time here. Well, welcome, DJ Eldar. Welcome into the ass. Uh, we're, we're, we're starting in a second here. I just do my little intro chit chat in the beginning. Let me know if you guys really hate the intro. Are you playing Super chat. Meat Boy? No, I'm not playing Super Meat Boy. Although maybe no. I should. You should! I want to see Super Meat Boy. I love Super Meat Boy. Maybe you I'll probably Super suck, Meat Boy. though. I'm really bad at it, yeah. You even talk about that guy. I never was beat it. I... Super Meat Boy, and it was just really ox sauce. Yeah, it was really. But in fairness to him, it did find out that he did have some problems but yeah. everybody was giving him shit though. everybody was giving him a lot of shit no i never beat super meat boy but um thou shalt caught miles shalt caught miles that's a lot of shalt teas you should salt the court is sexy miles. <laughs> are you you guys, you guys are fine with the intro chit chat i like the intro chit uh, chit chat i'm not gonna do super feet boy i i so cannot play i can't What's play the game with my hands boy? Uh, that's where Nick plays Super Meat Boy oh, with his feet. Oh, I can't. Oh yeah. god, I can't even. You're getting your ass kicked at a local Yu-Gi-Oh tournament. That's cool. <laughs> I hope you that's did the at least. Greatest excuse ever. <laughs> Why didn't you do your homework? I was getting my ass kicked at the <laughs> local Yu-Gi-Oh tournament. But so the reason that I mentioned uh, Spasm's game is um, he has a story on there, and I did the voiceover for it. But then I decided to rewrite the story, and I wanted to read it to you guys, because I wrote it, and it's long. But uh, we'll 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 read it at some point. I don't know if you guys want me to read it now or read it later or not read it at all. Like that's fair. Um, or we should just jump into Isaac. Maybe we should just jump into Isaac because I feel like people don't really want to watch that, and that's that's fair. That's like totally fair. Um, so hey, was was so so Super Meat Boy Forever? Was that the one that was announced? The Super Meat the No Team Mate game? What's up, Cat Flay? My anus is bleeding. Mine too. The chit chat is the best part. I'm glad you like it, Alex Rar. Read now. You guys want me to? You guys want me to read it? All right, all right. So I I he's got his story there uh, that I, I did the voiceover for. Um, let me let me change this to. Um, you, you're right there. I'm reading something really cute. Are you? I love love. That's good. <laughs> All right, let's uh, hold on. I'm getting screen regions Sorry. better, by the way. I'm really hyper. <laughs> and Maul's milady, thou shalt be courted by Sir Robert the Third. Doth that agree with thou? Sure, I'm good <laughs> with it, bro. <laughs> You had to read it in a silly voice. I'm gonna read. Uh, I will. I, I can't do silly. And Maul's my lady. <laughs> thou shalt be courted by Sir Robert the Third. There you Don't go. That's pretty good. Agree with thou. Yes, brother. That's the for show. <laughs> All right. So this is going to be the story for Alpaca Wait, Dungeon. Wait, I wanna. Re I wanna see it. Okay, it's on the stream right now. All right, we'll do this quickly, and then we're gonna get into Isaac. Don't you worry. I just Spaz wanna. Yeah, that's where I live right now. <laughs> yeah. In the ancient realm of Spasmandia lay a hidden kingdom shrouded in an enchanted mist, and guarded by this mist, a mighty sprawling metropolis called Alpacaria, the Woolly City, home to all alpacas. 
Alpacaria's resplendent citadel towered above the rest of the city, and if not obscured by that magical veil, would be seen from many leagues away. Young Prince Rob, lord of all alpacas, sit, sat the throne of Silky Fleece and led the alpaca patrol, an elite order of sentinels dedicated to truth and justice for all alpaca kind. Um, uh, wait a second, where am I? Uh, the patrol stood as an ever-vigilant guard against their first and most fearsome foe, the llamas. Century ago, centuries ago, the llamas were cursed with the everlasting dream, an arcane spell wrought by the first king of Alpacaria. The curse was sealed with the king's own lifeblood, destroying his royal body, but saving his magnificent kingdom and cloaking its majesty from any prospective hostile vader invaders. In memoriam, <coughs> bless you, in memoriam Sorry. of his monumental sacrifice, no kings ever sat the throne of Silky Fleece again. Instead, each sovereign was but a prince or princess, another child of the ancestral father of all alpacas. <laughs> but that was but a legend, the prince believed, and no llama had been seen in thousands of years. Oh my god, like the dinosaurs. Yeah, they're ba llamas are basically like dinosaurs. So th this they is the story... The dinosaurs haven't been seen in thousands of years. <laughs> Just only a thousand years since a dinosaur <laughs> has shown up. Uh... Actually, Did great you say creationism. Just threw up. <laughs> yeah, just it, well, I mean that that would make sense as well. Like if a dinosaur was only seen a thousand years ago, it's probably been a thousand years since the dinosaur's thrown up. Uh, if I leave, I'm consulting with my best friend, but I shall return my legion just in time to go to war without. Okay, glorious. Enjoy. All right, let's continue. Are you the warlock or the prince? Well, I'm the I'm Prince Rob probably, an alpaca oh. instead of the llama warlock. <laughs> okay, sorry. Oh, do you want me to be the llama warlock? Uh, you could be. Yeah, if you want. Nah, you can do it. You're a better voice. You could do. You could play Goral, the first, the first lady of uh, Alpacaria. Ooh, okay. okay. I do have my British voice. <laughs> Twitch didn't recognize your description. It's probably because it was a resub. Either way, welcome. I'm gonna give you. I'm gonna give you. I'm gonna give you a. Uh, that's a lot of nuts. Hold on a second. We got a lot. We got a lot of support nuts. today. There is like a train of support. Thank you guys so much. I should mention. That's a lot of nuts. But that's a lot of nuts. El Jesus of Sushiville, welcome back to the patrol. Thank you for subscribing. It goes a long way in supporting what I do and make a viable thing to do. So don that old cape and beat stick. And we'll stalk the night and search llamas and to strike fear into their hearts. Um, yeah, this is Rebirth. Anyway, no, this is the story to Spasm's game, which you can find at alpacadungeon.com. Um, hold on. There you go. Um, but anyway. Little did the young prince know that their ancient enemies from ages past were set to rise once more from their cursed slumber. Having broken the magical seals that bound him to his eternal sleep, the villainous warlock Aglamanim sought to do the same for his people and free his barbarous race. The warlock crafted a devious plan to awaken the llamas and destroy the alpacas in one fell swoop. Knowing he needed royal blood to break the esoteric curse, he lured Prince Rob into a trap after sneaking into the citadel. Um, oh no, Rob! I want to say, I want to actually change that to... Under How do you the warlock Aglamanim of, of a uh, something seer of a uh, something seer you know add something under the guise of a something seer a bomb oh. is oh wait oh yeah sorry this is this is the warlock a bomb is hidden somewhere in the gargantuan city and only I know the location of the key to disarming it to save your great people you will need only play a game with me my prince. What do you say to that? The warlock spat. You have to spit now. <laughs> um, <laughs> then thus came the alpaca aromancer, who was actually pretty bad at his job in stage. How do you pronounce the warlock's name? Aglamanim? Yep, that's it. Aglamanim. Aglamanim? Aglamanim. It's a play on agonim. He's a sea anemone, yeah. That's really what it is. Fearing him not, yet trusting him less, the brave and also super handsome prince inquired, What must I do? The key to the bomb is deep within my infinite dungeon. Simply defeat the labyrinth's trials to save your people. Tell you what Step. else is deep within my infinite dungeon. <laughs> is it your vagina? Um, it's a vagina. Oh, that's wonderful, Rabbit Wolf. Oh, oh that's awesome, it. Rabbit Wolf. Um, uh, standing beside him, Goral, the first lady of Alpacaria, questioned the warlock's game. 
Is this me? Yep. What's the catch, Llama? The dungeon, though treacherous, cannot truly kill you. If you die, you will be resurrected at the gatehouse of a new dungeon. Until he finds the key, the prince will be forever trapped within its walls. And either way, the warlock muse in his malevolent mind. I love that word, malevolent. I shall have the royal blood I require from the prince's death, key or no. The llama smiled a wicked smile. I would not trust this llama, my prince. You cannot believe his lies. I see no other choice. It is the only way. I will play your game, and I shall save Alpacaria once more. And so, Prince Rob descended into the dungeon to meet his fate, not knowing what to expect in its gloomy halls. Ooh, that's yeah. cool. So there you go. That's the uh, that's the uh, the rewritten script for uh, Alpaca Dungeon that I rewrote myself. Uh, and, um, yeah. I like Goral, Lady Goral. She's Go, pretty cool. She's pretty cool, yeah. She's a cool lady. Um, anyway, without further ado, let's get into Isaac. Um, Wait, if she's the first lady of Alpacaria, uh -huh. does that mean she's a lady in her own right, or she's married to someone? But I think she's supposed to be married to, uh, to Prince Rob. Ew, cooties. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Too spooky for me. Did you guys like that? <laughs> Dan had a thing. I liked it a lot. Did you? All right. I'm glad. Mm -hmm. I'm going to random seed and let's random the... Oh, we're going to play an Eve run. Yeah, so did I'd you guys see the rebirth shit on, out of that. on Twitch? You what? I would read the shit out of that. Would you? Yeah, that's <laughs> going to be the uh, the intro at the beginning of the uh, of the Alpaca Dungeon game. The, the overarching story. Uh, of the game, so um, I hope I did justice to Goro. Yeah, get those girls up in there for chat for Mal. Yeah, there you go. Oh, oh, thank you. I love you. The mighty Goral. Um, doing an Eve run. Yep, yeah, this is an Eve run because uh, whatever they they uh, they had actually in uh, Man vs. Games run of Rebirth, uh, he fought Larry Jr., which is pretty cool. Um, God, Eve sucks. <laughs> Although I think I heard that in remix they they changed Eve so that she's not uh, as bad. Like I don't think she has like a, a base tears down anymore. Look at those girls! Oh god, he is on hiatus. Yeah, it is. It is a, a hiatus basically for uh, for Long War. There's a lot of reasons, but uh, yeah, freeze! Ice to meet you. <laughs> Uh, Alex, I unfortunately I keep Skype for because of the the problems that I've had with Steam, adding people. Oh, cancer! Yes. Um, oh God. I keep. <laughs> it's really a good item in this game. But uh, anyway, yeah, I keep. Uh, I keep Skype for uh, for my own business business stuff. All right, I'm gonna look for a bomb. <laughs> Alpaca, the man, the myth, the dungeon. Alright, let's blow it up. <laughs> Rob, you're lame? No, you're lame! Hey, Freeze, so was Super Meat Boy Forever, is that the, uh, cause nobody fucking is telling me. Is Super Meat Boy Forever, is that the new Team Meat game that they announced? Was that the secret game? Because, I tell you what, they said, and I mentioned this, oh, Rusty Key, that doesn't actually do anything. Um, or, or it might, they might have fixed it in Remix, but, uh, it used to not do anything. But, uh, anyway, I, I'd rather have cancer, even if it did give me more more chests. Cancer, fuck yeah. You probably already got your answer, but uh, in the new Super Meat Boy is going to be shown to PAX live stream about two hours. Oh, so they're going to show they're gonna show Super Meat Boy forever in two hours. Yeah, then we'll watch that. Let's watch that. Do you guys want to watch that with me? No. Because I want to see it. It's the, uh, Super well, you're going to be gone. You're going to be hanging out with your girlfriend. Sorry. That trip, that sucks. Um, yeah, you better be. Um, but yeah, so Super Meat Forever is it's so it's so that should be the iOS Meat Boy, which if I'm if I'm thinking about it, sounds like it's probably gonna be an Infinite Runner Meat Boy, which sounds really cool actually. Like I would really like to play an Infinite Runner Meat Boy. Um, hey, double keys. Team Meat is actually fun to go back a dungeon now. That would be cool. You watch it with me. You know, you know there's an Alpaca Patrol poster on the cage. I did know that. Yeah, it's really cool, isn't it? 
it's pretty awesome. I'm pretty excited about that. So did you guys like my history of Alpacaria and the and the, the, the legend of the patrol? I like Goral. Raise your hand if Goral was your favorite character in the whole thing. You didn't like the Llama Warlock, a Glamanim? A Glamanim? No. It's I have a uh, anemone. It's actually it's a um it's a play on uh, on Aganim. Which is the uh, who is the evil wizard in Link to the Past? Oh, oh well, that sucks. Warmest greetings. My name is Thor. Your mom's name is Thor. Greetings, no, Thor. Rob. Can I be Rob's Odin? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I could. I could watch. We, we could. I could. I could watch it later. Can someone confirm for me? It's being shown two hours and ten minutes. I don't want to get wrong info. I refer to time or the time episodes wrong. Yeah, do the uh, go to time and date converter. That'll uh, that'll give you the the converted time zone properly. Hey, a Librari. Well, I guess I'll enter the Librari. We don't have a D6, unfortunately, but that's fine. Eternity. Ah, oh, God, I don't know what eternity is. We don't actually need the Book of Despair because the Book of Despair supposedly increases your fire rate for a uh, for a room and we have max fire rate so we wouldn't really want to do that uh Aghanim's is the best item in dota it's a pretty good item in dota as well which Aghanim scepter in dota is uh is based on the 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 legend of zelda legend of the patrol sounds like a sequel in the making rob maybe oh that'd be cool like if the oh okay we need to get this we need to get the habit it needs to happen it needs to happen chat Eternity, is that the one that gives you the white heart? I think Eternity is the one that gives you the white heart. Please. Oh, sweet baby Jingus. Sweet baby dog Jingus. We got it. We got the habito. Uh, like the story, however, I am a llama, so I feel a bit odd for liking it for Curl's my favorite character. I'm glad. Uh, what is my level compared to yours? What do you mean? Well, I'm clearly level 69, so I don't know. Really up to you to choose your own level, I suppose. Use the card. Yeah, I think uh, I think it's gonna give me um, the thing. Um, you said you're saying take the book. You want you want me to take book of despair? Why do I use that? I'd rather have the bottle of pills. I am reading the uh, uh, Amazon thing, Von Falcon. Good catch. What's the Amazon thing? Uh, these two, uh, these two people. One of them was uh, an Amazon customer service rep, and some random guy. They were like typing out chat and they role played there with Thor and Odin. It's actually kind of cute. That sounds cool. He's I like, this is outrageous. Who dares defy the old father Odin? What does it cure to cause this agony? I'm afraid the book I ordered to defeat our enemies has been misplaced. How can we keep Valhalla intact without our sacred book? This is blasphemy. Wherever this book has been taken to, I shall make it my duty to get it back to you. I fear it's Loki, but I dare not blame him for such things. I shall have your fortune returned to you, and thereafter we can begin to create a new quest in order to get the book back to you. He goes, okay, um, role play aside, can I have my money back and can I reorder the book? He goes, yeah, I've refunded you. You need to reorder the book. Great, have you placed it? <laughs> and it's just like, oh my god. That's good. Chat really wanted me to take Book of Despair for some reason, and they didn't tell me why. Uh, but now they're really upset that I didn't take it. What's so good about Book of Despair? Does, it just gives you max fire rate for a room, right? Bye, Rabid Wolf. I wasn't blowing my nose. Good night, Rabid Wolf. Yeah, I hope you feel better, Mal. I'm not sick! <laughs> Alright, let's this. Freeze says, I got my time zones wrong. Meat Boy is being shown in one hour and ten minutes. Oh, I see. It's closer rather than later. What's it's up, Paragon closer Spencer? to my face rather than fart. Oh, yeah. Rather than farter. <laughs> oh, come on! Alright, well, at least I can do that. No! Oh my god. I'm so mad. Mad is bad mostly, but, like, mostly just mad. So why is the Book of Despair good? Is it Norse mythology ass? Yeah, I think so. Hey, balls of steel. That's awesome. See? I like the pill bottle. What's so great about the stinky book of despair? Oh, fine. What about damn books? I know. Mm -hmm. What is what's up with the books? Because books are new. Oh, okay. That's only that's the only reason? It's not good. It's kind of bad. It's kind of a bad item. 
Ain't worth my time. <laughs> and we've seen it. We've done seen it before. I thought the reason that is like I didn't know some sort of combo that I uh, what? was missing out on. I know. Authorship markup is first in value. Mm -hmm. no, the habit isn't great. I mean, it's it's pretty good. I mean, like it's see, like it gives me this another balls of steel. You see, team, team. It's still pretty good. Did like, anybody it's... else hear about the Google authorship thing? No, what's that? Apparently, Google's ending its authorship project. I don't really understand what it is, though. Someone could enlighten me. Yeah, what is that? It says that its roots can be traced back to the company's agent rank patent of 2007. Bill Slosky, an expert on Google's patents, says that the agent rank patent is a type of system wherein multiple pieces of content are connected with a digital signature that represents one or more agents or authors. Google noticed that displaying the authorship information wasn't as useful as the company had thought it would be. At some point, it can even distract from the results. For these reasons, Google decided to axe the authorship project. Hmm, I don't really get it. Interesting. But, God bless. It's just not great in your situation. Dan Chad is not speaking of tongue. What are you speaking? <laughs> uh. So it's not a long thing like Rebirth? Alright, we. Get, I mean, I kinda wanna see it, but it's up to you guys if you guys wanna see it or not. Oh, right. The comic says, Rob, what would you do if Gabe Newell asked you to draw him as one of your French girls? I'd draw him as one of my French girls. Do you even have a French girl, Robert? Maybe. You have, like, no French girls, don't you? I don't have very many French girls, I'll be honest. <laughs> um, well, I could get a shitload of money. Before I get a shitload of money, though, let's go find out what's in the shop. Because maybe it's something I want, maybe it's not. Is, it, is there a video of the man versus... Yeah, there is. Someone someone has it, actually. Um, of the uh, man versus game stream. It wasn't it wasn't on his channel. It was on the Twitch channel. It's cool. What did you do? Oh, yeah, you already said that. T, are you a genderless anthropomorphic blob of donkey? <laughs> yeah. You don't really have a gender. You're a donkey. I am a French girl. Cody Kaspiri says that he will be my French girl. You can be my French girl and I can draw you. I'm alright with that. I don't know how many times I could have used that. Probably more than I did. It's fine. That's a lot of nuts! Oh my god, that's a lot of nuts! Eatkins95! The sub chain or train or whatever it is is real today. Eatkins95, welcome to the patrol. Thank you for subscribing. It goes a long way in supporting what I do and making it a viable thing for me to do. So eat some kins in '95, in the year '95. Oh, maybe that was like a maybe that's like a historical reference. That's when all the kins were eaten in '95. Anyway, welcome to the patrol. Thank you for subscribing. It's it's wonderful. Don that cape and beat stick. We'll stalk the night and search llamas and lords strike fear into their hearts. <laughs> One of my stars. <laughs> that's a really good uh, ASCII emote. Never-ending party. So, you know what's actually kind of funny is... Oh, I did it too much. Well, I could use Bad Trip. You know what? I am going to use Bad Trip. Because why not? Let's get enough money to sustain us for the rest of the run. You know what I mean? We all knew Malls was Jack and Rob was her French girl. I'm actually really good at drawing people's faces. I'm not really good at drawing anything else, though. Bad Trip doesn't become... Full health? Anymore? Why? I didn't know that. Oh, that's terrible. <laughs> oh, that's terrible. We might die. We might die a horrible death. I'm gonna use this and hope for a heart. Shit. Bad trip I'm is just bad. A monster. I'm Rob, now there's another new monster. 3DS. Maybe the old 3DS. This is my very last monster the, in the um, refrigerator. I don't <laughs> think that the I don't think the capture cards are gonna go down because the thing is it's, it's 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 just done by this one dude. So like, it's not gonna. I probably not, it's probably gonna go down. I had a spiritual. Yeah, but that doesn't affect it. That never used to affect it. 
that didn't affect it before. So I guess that's new in Remix is because I had a, uh, I had a blue heart. I'm, I'm going to retweet your tweet because I'm such a good person. I believe it. Takes into consideration, Spirit Hearts, you only have half a heart, heart of life. You will, okay, so now it's it's clear that yes, that is why, but uh, but that it didn't used to do that. Oh, hey, greed. Fuck greed. It's actually all right. I was considering doing this. I was just hoping that I didn't lose that blue heart. Um, but I was considering doing this just to keep my um, the horror of Babylon going. Why are you talking about me to the chat? <laughs> right here. Um, my energy drink of choice is the low carb monster, aka the blue one. Uh, or I guess any energy drink, I guess I'll, I'll go for, but I really like monster. And I know we get into a debate saying, my cake's bad for you and you're so gross. I know it's bad for you and I know it kind of tastes gross. But hey, Shit. I'll drink, it's how I stay awake. This is like the Russian sleep experiment, hardcore shit. And now it makes me interesting because I'm really boring without it. It's true, yeah. Like extremely I hate boring. You. <laughs> I hate you so much. Hey, so we got full health. We're fine. We're fine. Hey, so we got full health. We're fine. We're fine. Tell me the truth. Why do you, why do you want to take Dad's key? Dad's key is like the trashiest trash ass item the trash ass has ever trashed. It's terrible. Hey, it's the super secret room. Oh man, watching Rebirth though really makes me just wish that I was playing Rebirth right now. Not that Remix is bad, Remix is great, but I mean, man, I really do wish I could play the uh, the old Rebirth Arena. <laughs> Uncle Fucker 69 says, Psst, "Hey malls, want to buy some dongers? God damn, that's a great price you got there, friend." <laughs> he didn't actually give a price. Nah, just trying to have just be good. Whatever. Right. Malls, why not drink coffee or tea? Monsters and Because I don't really like coffee. It kind of tastes like chalk to me. And tea always reminds me of my mom. And I don't really like tea. I like my mom, but... <laughs> yeah, I was going to say. I really like tea. <laughs> kind of fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> I don't really like tea either. They're just... They're like sugary stuff. Yeah, I like tea. Tea's delicious. Yeah, I like sugary stuff. I gotta have my sugar. You can put sugar in tea. I know, but it's not the same for me. I put sugar in tea. I like feeling my heart speed up, like like that. Yeah. We have we have lots of mods in here, actually. I'm at, I'm here. Yeah, Maul's here. Freeze, Freeze is, is here. here. Whoa, what the? All right, that was some lock oh, controls that just occurred there. Is oh, if you look if you look at the viewer box? list, it says none of the mods are here. Oh, I see. Um, the comics, I'd say it's both. It's both complex and it can be difficult. It, uh, it depends though. Like, it, it depends on, like, your start. It depends, it depends on a lot of factors, really. It, a lot of times it depends on how lucky you are. Because, uh, luck does play, play a role in that game. It's got roguelike elements. I'll go in here. Oh, okay. That would be cool. Maybe we'll do that. Is Freeze really here, though? Is Freeze? Nah, man. He's we not. just think he's here. All right, I'm gonna go fight the boss, and then we'll consider what I do to the old uh, didgeridoo, as it were. Maul's gonna die from drinking too much monster confirmed. Hey, we all die someday, honestly. I can't think of a better way to die. Than drinking monster? I can think of a lot of better ways to die. Well, it's how I want to die. You can't tell me how to die, Rob. You want to die of a heart attack from drinking First energy off, drinks? You tell, me, you tell me exactly what kind of bread to buy, and you judge me for All not. Right. But you should and get good bread. And now you're trying to bread. tell me how to die. Don't <laughs> suck a dick. I wouldn't really want to go into cardiac arrest from drinking too much energy drinks, to be honest. But, you know, maybe that's just me. God damn it. Oh, Air Brev says he saw some advertising bots. So just want to let him on. Okay, I will be on the lookout. Freeze, get your shit together, fucker. Freeze, what is wrong with you? Literally, what the fuck, Freeze? What is actually wrong with you? I have to disagree in parts of the game is complex for beginner. 
Even after you get some experience, except for a couple shitty starts, like you do, as an example, you don't need luck. Yeah, no, I mean, well... Yeah. But it's still, I mean, it's still complex. I, it's, it, whether, whether it's complex for a beginner or not, it's still complex. I guess I should take the Book of Revelations, huh? I guess I will take that. Pretty damn good. How, how fast would I shoot? So I'm shooting this fast right now. <laughs> you can't fly or me, I quit. <laughs> um, I think, I think CK2 is still complex. You just get used to it after a while and then it's a lot easier for you, but, uh, still complex matter what but um the uh it, it, it yeah i mean it can be pretty easy after a while but that's after you like learn all of the mechanics like it takes a while to do that like it's not it does it's not it's not super fast that you uh that you learn how to do that really i should be doing that just to get my um i probably will actually I you can't fire me, I quit. I can't. Blah, blush. Oh, I'm in a glass case of emotion. That emotion is gratitude. Five dollar donation from live coding sessions. There's no message, but thank you so much for the five dollar donation. Live coding sessions, thank you for the support. It's wonderful. Oh, God. Thank you so much. This, this is a supporty support stream. It must be because I'm the only one streaming on, on Earth. Hmm. That must be what it is. That must be what's going on here. Oh, right. That's cool. Uh, hey, Rob, Lord of the Butts. How's it going? I am uh, actually Prince Rob, Lord of all alpacas. We, uh, we figured that out earlier when I wrote the story of the patrol. Um. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Let's play this down to forty cents, and then uh, and then be done with it. And get some blue hearts. I mean, that would be pretty nice. Cause then I could potentially get a devil room on the next floor. It'd be amazing. Paragon Spencer says Rob is the last man on Earth. Confirmed. Miles has no choice now. Are you actually the last man on Earth? Yep. Not even. It, yes, even. Everyone seems no. to be at PAX. I know, everyone's at PAX. That's why I'm the, I'm the last. Not even if you were the last man on Earth. Wow. 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 All right, see you later, uh, Aeromancery. Enjoy All your my Aeromancery. All are at PAX, and I want to punch something. Me too. You, you know what Nick tweeted me last night? He's like, Maul, stop not being at PAX. Just rubbing it in. <laughs> Uh, I do wish I was at PAX. It seems it seems real fun. I almost tweeted him a picture of an infected penis. <laughs> That's gross. Yeah. That's true, uh, Sir Strafe. It's very true. I uh, you've tweeted you and you didn't and retweeted thine ass announcement. Thank you, Alex Verus. Uh, oh goodness. Oh goodness. Bye, Aromancery. I probably missed you, but bye. Yeah, I said uh, I said goodbye to Aromancery. You did. That's good. Until just I, now. I was okay. Yeah, exactly. You heard me. I, I want to find the I boss as quickly apologize. as possible. Go fucking suck. Effective Take with the Necronomicon? No. The Book of Revelation is so much better right now. All right. So that's not the boss. That boss now. That's I would boss. totally wear a sash that says Lord of the Butts. Dude, I've always wanted to wear a sash. I've always wanted to square a cash. You can shut up. I can, but I'm not going to, though. I think you should. Well, I mean, that's fair, yeah, but your, that's like... Your, your sense of humor... I saw your Mount Your Friends video with Nick. I saw Nick's Mount Your Friends video, and he said that his sense of humor is like double sarcasm, which I appreciate. And yours is just switching around the letters. Yeah, I mean, it's It's true. not that great. Not that great. It's pretty good. Uh, I would take it to PAX if I was going. Oh, that's nice. What is the meaning of life? Uh, 42. I'd say the meaning of life is to help others as much as you can. 
And stay positive. That doesn't really sound like a meaning of something. It sounds more like a like a like a fortune cookie. That's what we're on. That's why, in my opinion, that's what life is about. Just making, helping it's others and being happy. No, Robert, and I'm about to fly over to New York and punch you right in the nuts. Because you are really trying me right <laughs> it's now. Not, it's not about fortune cookies. I think my life is about fortune cookies. Honestly. I don't get fortune cookies. Actually, the Chinese food place that I order from doesn't actually have fortune cookies, which is kind of bullshit. If you ask me. Well, Damn it! The bullshit boss is right restaurant here. for a big piece of bullshit. <laughs> yeah, basically. Well, we're getting a cube of meat. That's okay, though, because we can still get a devil room, which would be nice. Uh, Rob, that's gross. I know, I'm sorry. I'm just a, a gross man. Um, Rob, I love that Alex you just made that Ferris reference. says, Sir Robert, thou shalt... Sir Robert, thou should thank Madame... Madame Malls, Lady Malls, to you, bitch. <laughs> wow! <laughs> that was close. <clears throat> We're not really doing any damage. We're still doing, like, base damage, which sucks. So what I want is a guppy's paw so that I can be what's-her-face forever. Um, or a Babylon forever. You can't find me, I quit. It's weird that that one exploded. Oh, my God. <clears throat> when it did. Aww, 48657869646563696D616C said, Mom's must be a cookie of some sort because how else would she be so sweet? Aww. You know, you've never said anything nice like that to me. Yeah, Thank four, you, 48657. <laughs> 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 uh... You're gonna die, war. <laughs> You're gonna die. I'm gonna kill ya. Does he explode into? No, he doesn't. Hey, but brave, we got a devil. Brave, room. brave, brave, Sir Robert. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yes, and fuck it. <laughs> Dasa Ryan says, "Sir, not appearing in this stream." <laughs> Can we just make a bunch of Monty Python jokes and people who don't get it have to suck a dick? And your grandfather smelled of elderberries. One day, lad, all oh, this will be yours. What the curtains? Not the curtains, lad. This farmland as far as the eye can see. <laughs> but, mother. Father, I don't want this all that. Alright, I think I'm going to go into the sacrificial lamb, <coughs> lamb room. You're wrong, and the meaning of life is actually uh, trying to be nice to people, avoid eating fat, reading a book every now and then, get some walking in, try to live together, visit. Yes, that's true. Oh, God. Well, I almost did something really terrible. <coughs> Accidentally. Oh, what? yes. Okay. What'd you call me? I said stop burping. I don't want to. All right, I hope that the sacrificial or the uh, sacrificial shop is not a um, greed. <laughs> Just a flesh food. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, thank I wanna, you, I, Ladder. I want to watch Holy Grail, too. It's a good movie. We should all watch it together. That'd be against the law. <laughs> we wouldn't do that. Unless we went on to, like, livestream.com or something, in which I don't care about the rules, in which case, then I would. Or maybe I wouldn't, because that would be illegal. Now stand aside, worthy adversary. Tis but a scratch. A scratch? Your arms off! No, it isn't. What's that, then? I've had worse. You lie a con, you pansy! I have that whole movie memorized, and it's quite sad. <clears throat> Thing is, is I tried to get my dad into it. Like, Dad, hey, watch this. He's like, um... I don't really like British humor. And he's married to a British lady. Yeah, I was gonna say, how, how? <laughs> I'm like, I don't understand. Game kids all right, I guess. <laughs> Fuck it. The chat thinks you're burping. And they're I... saying stuff. Wow. <laughs> wow. Or maybe they're in on the joke. 
I hope so. I would guess that at least a few of them were not. <laughs> African or European swallow. <laughs> <laughs> What makes you think she's a witch? Oh, she turned me into a newt! A newt! <laughs> I got better. Better anyway! <laughs> Terry Gilliam, you know, was gonna direct um, Harry Potter, and then they took it away. Really? From yeah. That it sucks, because. Nah, it would have been awesome if Terry Gilliam directed Harry Potter. He And he was, like, really mad about it, too. Like,. He was really mad that uh, that the other guy got the directorship of uh, of Harry Potter, and then oh, I'm a, such a fucking idiot, and yeah. um, and then um, <laughs> he was he was really mad about it, and he said like he didn't he didn't make it magical enough and stuff, but then he did say that he liked the third one, and I like the third one too. Miles' mom not funny according to her dad, yeah, basically. <laughs> Apparently, I was like, Dad, this is such a funny movie. He's like, Yeah. I don't really like British humor. And I'm like, what the fuck, Dad? <laughs> I don't really like British people. <laughs> I just did it so your mom could get citizenship. <laughs> oh my god. My mom got citizenship way before she met my dad. How else was she allowed to have her kids in, uh, in America? You know what I mean? That's what I thought. I don't think no, that's how no. it works. What else floats in water? Bread, apples, very small rocks. Cider, gravy, cherries, mud, churches, lead, lead, a duck. <laughs> I'm sorry. What? Do you have a problem with Monty Python, Robert? Yeah, I have a huge problem with Monty Python. <laughs> Don't that explain uh, right? What do you think about Doctor Who last Saturday? I thought it was good, but it's not as good as, like, the 11th hour. Yeah, I, this is what I said last time, uh, was that... I liked Peter Capaldi. I thought the episode was pretty bad. It was kind of lame. I watched it with my nephews, and they're even they're like 13 and 11 respectively, and they were like, "This is kind of crappy." And I was like, <laughs> "Yeah." <laughs> it was weird. They were like writing for Matt Smith and not Peter Capaldi, and it was just like, uh... and I thought that like I that Stephen Moffat said like. Uh, <clears throat> we're going to, you know, <gasps> throw away some of the old conventions and stuff. And then, like, they stuck with all the other stuff. Freeze. Um, I was going to tell you, but my aunt and my uncle are visiting from Wales right now. And they live in Port Talbert, like, three blocks away from the beach there. And my aunt was telling everybody that the beach shot that they got in the new Doctor Who episode, like, on the beach, was, like, on that beach where they live, so, and I've been there a couple times, so I'm going to go back, and I'm going to, like, pee on the sand or something. See, McGresta doesn't like, yeah, like, is, is it common that people really hate Clara? I think Clara's a no. pretty decent companion. I don't a think lot of people like Clara. Yeah, I don't, I don't have a problem with Clara. The problem is that they were writing Peter Capaldi as if he were Matt Smith, which I don't like, and then also, it's like, stop fucking, stop Stephen Moffat with the lizard lady. I don't care about the lizard lady. I'm never gonna care about the lizard lady. Just yeah. stop it. Just stop it. I don't care. I don't care about the lizard lady. I will never yeah. care about the lizard lady. Stop trying to push the fucking lizard lady. Okay, we get it, Rob. It's just very annoying to me, because it's like, very common in the fucking Matt Smith. It's just like, like, oh yes, here's some more lizard lady. And it's just like, you guys love the lizard lady, don't you? And I'm like, I, no, I don't, I don't. I don't. Um, I don't, I don't really care for the lizard lady, and I don't think anybody else does, I think you're right. I really do like Clara, I think she's a pretty good companion, I like solid. Clara too, I think she's, I think she's a decent Yeah, companion. like, I go on Twitter and everybody's like, losing their shit and jizzing all over Clara, it's like... I think her okay. story is stupid. Yeah. Like, I, I don't like her story, but I, as a, like, as a companion herself, I think she's cool. Like, as Don, a I, character. I thought Donna was okay. Donna Noble's good, yeah, she's a real good, uh, companion. She's not my favorite, to be honest. Oh my god. Come and see the violence inherent in the system. Help, help, I'm being repressed. That's, uh, <laughs> yeah, no, the, um, Nick's favorite companion's Donna Noble. Just came back from the pack stream. Ah, what's up, Kepfle? I mean, I am basically racist against the lizard lady. But seriously, she's just so boring. Like, I don't care. Like, I just, yeah, I don't care. Yeah, with that care. whole veil thing, I was like, when is this done? 
It's so annoying. That My nephew was literally like, 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 he's like the nicest kid, but he's like, am I? He's like, I'm so done with the stupid veil. <laughs> I'm like, yeah. Just done with the fucking lizard lady. Like, I, like it, it's like Steven, If you didn't get your oh oh what intriguing. Okay. Shit. I mean, that's all right, I guess, honestly. But, um... I did want to, uh... I did, I did want to go to the rest of the floor. So that's what Corruption do does. Maybe it teleports you, but maybe it just teleports you... No, Corruption <laughs> definitely has to teleport you to the, um... To the IM error room. Alright, well, we've learned something. That's what Corruption like does. Like Resta says, I wish Lizard Lady was companion over Clara just for Rob's salt. <laughs> I just don't like the Lord of Butts, Lady, 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 Lady of Butts, tomorrow, oh my god, tomorrow is what? Is it your name day? Nice. Happy early birthday. You missed the blue rock on the right. Did I? Happy birthday to, oh wait no. Uh, that's happy Luda, birthday. Luda Cavolo happy technique. Birthday. Happy, happy birthday to you. I said happy birthday, happy birthday, happy, happy birthday to you. But, uh, but no, like with the Lizard Lady, it's like, <laughs> It's like, okay, Steve. Just keep going. Just Steve, keep going. like, if you haven't gotten, if you haven't gotten your spin-off show yet, it ain't coming. Whoa, the Jawbreaker. What does this do? Well, you know what? We can stick with the Jawbreaker. I don't know what the Jawbreaker is, but I guess we're gonna, we're gonna take it. Maybe it works like, um, maybe it works like the tooth shot randomly, like a worse tooth shot. <laughs> Oh, it's all happening. All right. So now we are the Whore of Babalan, which is great, because that increases our damage by quite a bit. Yeah, we're doing quite five damage, which is all right, actually. It's not as good as I was hoping, but it's all right. Still better. Yes. Wiggle Worm. Now, I'm going to stick with the Jawbreaker. It's a new... Uh, it's a new item or a new trinket. I wanna, I wanna try it. Oh, yep, it does work like I, I expected. It does the tooth shot. That's cool. Rob, I can promise you, having seen some of the future episodes, the reason Coldy is written like Matt Smith, that was being post regen. Yeah, I, I, I figured that. Like, I, I figured that. I figured that was the thing, but like, it was also. I mean, just I don't kinda... have a problem. I didn't really have a problem with Capaldi. Like, good, God bless. Good job. Like, I assume, like, right after being regen, he's gonna be a little similar so they can ease people into it, but... Yeah, like, I just thought the story was a little, like, Meh. Yeah, the story was, was whack. Like, it was... I... I didn't... I, it was kind of weird that they didn't actually go into... I'm in a glass case of emotion, and that emotion is gratitude! One dollar donation from Kalspiri! This, this one is for the Swagwar. P.S. Chaos Spiri. Oh, Chaos Spiri. Oh, I'm still gonna call you Caspiri though. Um, wow. <laughs> I just Christmas. like it more. Uh, but uh, anyway, <laughs> thank you for the one dollar donation. The uh, the 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 support is real tonight. You guys are so wonderful. Thank you so much. He has oh, a tear in his eye. Confirmed. I do. The support is so wonderful. <laughs> No, get under the fire. Can you hurt that thing? You can't hurt that thing for me, you bastard. I don't All think right, we stream stopped. tomorrow, Alex, so... Or at least I don't think Rob... Uh, Rob, 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 uh, whatever. I don't know, Rob's stream schedule has been so weird lately. Has it? That yeah, really has. It's been, like, you know, my normal times. By the way, if it's your first time on the Astro stream every Monday, Wednesday, Fridays, Mondays, Wednesdays at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, Fridays at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, you're watching the Friday show, and uh, we'll be back on Monday after this one, or we're gonna do a casual stream over the weekend, maybe. It's depends. That's what I mean. Well, yeah, sometimes we do casual streams. That that happens. Yeah, not before. Now you do. That's what I mean by that. Well, if I have uh, if I have something to play, then I do a casual stream. That's, uh, that's how it's always been. Yeah, it usually lasts about nine hours. <laughs> sometimes that happens. Yes. Yes. It's fucking dumb. Um, I think I want to stick with the candle. I don't really want to do that. 
<laughs> you manky Scots get. Every time we talk to Freeze now, we're not allowed to call him Freeze. We have to call him you manky Scots get. I'm fine with that. Okay. Because yeah. he's from fucking Scotland. Oh, What's he do? Nibble your bum? <laughs> hmm. That didn't work as I had actually initially intended. Um, <laughs> that's unfortunate. But, it, I mean, sure, I guess. Alright, as people have mentioned, I do need to find a, uh, a blood bank so that I can get my... Uh, retain my Whore of Babylon. It's not, like, totally necessary, but, you know, it's fine. It's fine if we don't get it. It's not the biggest deal in the world, but if we do, it's great. So, we shall attempt to do so. Back at what's the pussy? How long is the stream gonna be? Go for it, say, say seven more hours. I don't know. Uh, it's really, like, like I said, it's up to my discretion. The, um, the stream, like I said, uh, or like I have said, I didn't say that recently, but, uh, in the rules down below, it's minimum two hours. Minimum, it's two hours. Generally, we go to three. Uh, sometimes it is two, but very rarely. And, whoa, that was close. Uh, very rarely we go to only two. And sometimes it just can be way more than three. <laughs> so, you know, it's, just, it's sort of a guideline, the rules of, like, it's minimum. All right, so we can't find a thing, which is unfortunate. But it's not the biggest deal in the world. It's only like two extra damage per hit. Could take the book of Belial. Rob, what's your favorite liquor? I know you don't like it, but I have to drink something. What would it be? I would go for tequila. He only drinks beer. I do only pretty much. Wow, you're beer. a trashy white girl. What? Tequila's delicious. What are oh you talking God, about? Oh my God, more tequila shots. Woo! Dude, yeah, nice. tequila is fucking delicious. I don't know what you guys, what you're tequila talking about. Tequila Mockingbird. Does anybody know the Knights of the Round Table song from Monty Python? I'm just having a really nice walk down memory lane. I'm taking a sconce down memory lane. We're Knights of the Round Table, we dance when we're able. We do routines and core scenes with flip and pet cable. We dine while here on Camelot, we eat ham and jam and spam a lot. Uh, spam is gross. <laughs> my mom, uh, oh my god. My mom's ex-boyfriend uh, was Puerto Rican. And, uh, it's, it's a very, in, in, like, um, uh, Spanish cooking, spam is used very regularly. And he, he, he did spam all the time, and, oh man, it's gross. I don't like spam yeah. at all. I used to eat it, but it's just like, man. And it's not, you know what, it's not even the fact that it's processed meat. I have nothing wrong with the processed meat. I'd eat the processed meat. It's just filled with salt. So much salt. Maul and Rob, on a scale of one to ten, what's your favorite color in the alphabet? Uh, three is my lucky number, so three. So probably uh, blue. I don't have either of those things. Wow, you should. I you just have a don't. Color. Not really. Well, you do. You told me, you idiot. All right, what did I tell you? Because I don't remember. Fucking dumb. What was it? I don't remember. You told- Remember I thought, oh, I thought your favorite color is green. You're like, nah, probably like blue or black. Yeah. I mean, I wear pretty much only black. <laughs> spam, spam salt. Yeah, that's- I mean, it is. It's just filled with salt. So much salt and spam. And the thing that creeps me out about spam or Crisco or whatever is that you can use it for other stuff other than cooking, and that turns me off. Yeah. Hey, Mr. Lord Dark. Mr. Lord Dark! That's a good one. 69 is your favorite color? It's my favorite color as well, I'd have to say. Yeah, fuck it. Brave Sir Robin ran away. Bravely ran away, away. When danger reared its ugly head, he bravely turned his tail and but It's brave Sir Robin turned about and valiantly he chickened out. <laughs> Taken to his feet, he beat a very brave retreat, bravest of the brave, Sir Robin! <laughs> Wait, why did I get a wow rob? What did I do? My Steam name is is Meaty Spam, if anyone's up for some Dota or booty. Sit. I they said you're back and forth. I'm going, when what? Uh, they said you're so damn back and forth. First you ain't got a favorite color, then it's blue, and now it's 69. 
<laughs> yeah, that's true. Yes, yeah. The uh. I don't think I'm gonna end the stream for for Super Meat Boy, but I'll probably we'll probably watch it together. I think it's only 15 minutes long. When does that start? Does that start now? No, it starts in about half an hour or so. Half an hour? Oh no! It was judgment the whole time. That's terrible. Well, it's all right. We could get another thing. Damn, we missed our opportunity. Oh, fuck. We missed our opportunity at even getting the Polaroid. Why are we getting wow up? Oh, you guys are just trolling me, you bastards. I see. King I see. Of the King of the North! King of the North! Camelot. Camelot. It's half an hour? Camelot. Okay. It's a model. <laughs> That's fine. Uh, yeah, I well, I think I fixed it during the stream right now, but I have to. I'd have to restart the stream to get it uh, working. So, and I don't know if it's actually fixed fully. So, um, basically, we'll, we'll we'll fix it for next stream. It'll be it'll be all fixed up. Um, uh, me, my Gager says good day, Bobbert and Mollus. Did you go to uni or college? Would you study? I went to college sucked. Is there a difference? Uh, yeah, uni is, uh, like... British. The Europe, European thing, so... Ah, it's, it's the same thing. Or, yeah, it is the same thing. That's just, I'm just reading what he said. Oh, Ooh. my God. Uh, no, new game. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a, it's a Isaac Infinite Runner, is what I would imagine it is. I don't know if that is the case, but it seemed like an Isaac Infinite Runner, if you ask me. So maybe it is that, maybe it's not that. Or not an Isaac Infinite Runner, a uh, Mii Boy's Infinite Runner. Oh! I missed. I'm terrible. Alright! Um, was there anything else I wanted to do? Oh, if I have money. Okay, alright. Here's what I'll do. I want to get some money, so I'm gonna go over here. Why are they telling you to restart the stream, like little babies? Because they want me to use the more fox. Um, can you not? It's really annoying. Wow. Um, we're gonna go hey, get some money. Hey, my friend is reading Game of Thrones. I'll tell her you hated it. Really? I'm reading Game of Thrones. Yeah. Oh, the new Meat Boy has levels and bosses? Really? That's cool. And a defined end. Alright, so I'm completely wrong. I am completely wrong. It's not as I expected. It'd be cool if it was an infinite runner. But apparently it's one touch. So I guess... Oh, so it's like more like a bit trip runner kind of thing. That's cool. I'm down on that. Oh, my God. Ugh. Oh, you really like the idea of a new Super Meat Boy? Shut up. Yeah, yeah, you do. Oh god, who doesn't? And take your bunnies. Is there something else in here that I could blow up? I could blow you up. Why didn't I do that? I'm a dummy. Hmm, okay. Adios, Fine. Alex Ferris 01. Good night, Alex Ferris! Thank you for joining me on the ass. It also has an endless random mode. Ah! So it is an infinite runner after the regular runner. So it's like a bit trip runner that has an. Okay, that's cool. That's really cool. I can like you, that. Can you link the uh, Square Pigs Love Apples and Hate Limes game? I want to play it. Type in Rob's Real Game and put, uh, like, the Marley Bot link and then make uh, Real Capital. Do I use a tilde? Yep, tilde. Rob's real game. Did I do it? Yep. Is she even working today? No, I said make real capital. Oh my god, you said make Rob capital. I did not say that. So it's Rob and real capital? No, just real capital. Just make real <laughs> capital. See, Wait, I'm all gonna, of real I'm capital? I'm gonna fucking fight you. Real game. Yes, all of real, by the way. <laughs> 
And it doesn't even work. Marleybot died I'm again. Real gay. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking murder you. Rob's real game. <laughs> Rob's real capital game. The uh, the um, someone could just leave. <laughs> it's not hard to find. You could look up if you look up uh, square pigs love apples, they hate limes. Uh, on and then uh, if you Google uh, square pigs love apples scratch, then uh, then you'll find it. Also, Freeze made a better one, though, so... I found it. I don't care about Freezes. I'm wow. gonna beat this one. No offense, Freeze, but I'm, I'm gonna wow. beat this stupid one. This fucking shit one. Just wow. kidding, sorry, Rob. Wow. <laughs> Marleybite killed itself so it wouldn't deal with Malls. Hey, he said capitalize Rob! I did not say that. <laughs> yes, Chat is Rob's here to confirm. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> Chat, you should agree with me, because then I'll give you hugs. Oh, this fucker. Whatever, fine, I'll give you bombs. Hey, Rob, Are speak, you please. kidding me? How's it going? I see how it is, Maul. Oh, goodbye, DJ Elder. Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. That's fine, I guess. <laughs> Sorry, Freeze. Oh, what's up, Leeds? How's it going? Oh my god. Ooh. Thank you for dropping apples right in my head so I don't have to dick around. Yeah. Woo! Sexy mama. <laughs> That's not you. I'm not a sexy mama? Not really. Wow. Alright. I mean, you could be if you just dressed yourself up a little bit, made yourself look pretty. Your mom looks pretty. My mom is actually a very pretty woman. I believe it. It must be the European stuff. I believe it. <laughs> Do they just, like, give Europeans European stuff and that's how they get pretty? Yeah. I mean, Europeans are usually way more attractive than Americans. Ah, uh, I won't say on the whole. I would say on the whole whole. <laughs> oh, that's gross. The, <laughs> the uh, I won't say on the whole because there are some. I'm the whole of the There's whole. some fugly Europeans. <laughs> I think if you go to like Scandinavia, everyone's beautiful in Scandinavia. Yeah, it's kind of ridiculous, actually. No, Innocent Kitten actually. Um, I was looking at my Twitch or my Twitter analytics, and uh, you can't really see it on the <laughs> Twitch analytics, unfortunately. But uh, but the um. <laughs> The, on the analytics, uh, Brits are, Brits are pretty common. <laughs> pretty common. Pretty common viewers. Cool. Almost as common as Canada, actually. Oh, handy. Blue heart? <laughs> Alright. Uh, Book of Shadows. Freed says it's true, I'm very attractive. <laughs> Rob, Maul's oh, just yeah. called you ugly. You gonna take that? Oh. Um, I mean, I am. I mean, yeah, you take it. Take it good. <laughs> no. I'm not saying I think you're ugly. I said I think, on a whole, America is not as attractive as Europeans. Maybe. <laughs> Went to Norway, can confirm. See? Like, Scandinavia is just, that's where they keep all the pretty people on Earth. It's like, here's where you're going to stay, and here's where the ugly people are going to yeah. stay. You stay in your lane. <laughs> like, seriously, everyone is fucking beautiful in Scandinavia. Mm hmm It's weird. That's also why I've wanted to move to, like, Norway or Sweden or something. Wow, I see But I probably, is. you know, you probably just wouldn't have I a chance with that. I definitely see how it is, Robert. <laughs> but, like, you know, as a, as a, you know, saggy American, probably wouldn't have a chance with any, uh, Swedish or Finnish or, uh, Norwegians. Maybe they like that sort of thing. Maybe. I mean, maybe it works. Maybe it works the same way that oh, having like a British it. accent in America works. Because like, if you have a British, by the way, if you guys, if there are any British people in here and you're having trouble getting ladies, and uh, you have like a thousand dollars to blow, doesn't matter what you look like, come to America. You will get so <laughs> laid. You will get the most laid ever. Just come to America. All right, see you later, Swap Mist. Come to Norway. You can stay for free. Really? That sounds nice. Bullshit. What? I, I know a Norwegian that I can think about turning gay for. Yeah, that's that's uh, that's reasonable, man. 
Sometimes you just gotta turn gay for a hot guy. Norway's the best rap. Norway has the least scary food. Does it? A out of the out of all the all, all the places? Like, I'm gonna use Ewan McGregor as an example. He just got better with age. Maybe it's a genetic thing, maybe it's a him thing, but I think it has something to do with the fact that he is he Scottish or Irish? I can't remember, but he's very attractive. I don't know. Dudes in general though, uh Dudes in general are are very lucky in that uh generally men Way to go is men are more are more likely to be more attractive as they age rather than the the, the opposite. Wow. Denmark needs some love too. No, I'm just saying it's true though. Sounds like you like men. That's what that's, <laughs> that's what my mom always told me is that men get better with age and women don't. But, uh, but it's just not necessarily true, because, I mean, shit, look at Helen Mirren. She is fucking fine. She, oh my god, I want to motorboat her, like, oh, every day. Oh, god, I'd motorboat the shit out of Helen Mirren. I think that's her all the time. She's, like, the <laughs> oldest lady I would bang, and she's, like, 80. Yeah, she's she, really attractive, and she's She's sassy. so like, fine. Whoop. Oh, yeah. And she's, she's a knight. You know, she's Dame so Helen Mirren. You know who else seems really cool? Is Julie Andrews. Like, she seems like a cool fucking grandma. Probably. Yeah. He's Scottish? Oh, okay. Ewan McGregor's Scottish. Norway's so damn to the point where I often question my Norwegian girlfriend's sanity. Really? You have a Norwegian girlfriend? Is she really, wow. really hot? She hot? She's probably really, really hot because she's Norwegian. Is this death? What did I have? Oh, bad trip. Well, that's basically useless. Uh, Keith Beckendale's gonna be beautiful forever. Maybe. It's possible. I believe it. There are, yeah, like, Helen Mirren is just, She just is banging. so fucking fine. She is so fine. Like, I would totally bang Helen Mirren. I'd watch. Yeah, me too. I would bang Helen Mirren, make a clone of myself so that he can watch me banging Helen Mirren. That's how much I would bang Helen Mirren. For a second, I was really afraid that you were going to watch me and Helen Mirren, and I was like, eh, I'm I gonna. would also watch that. Yeah, I'd watch that. Just saying, I would... Move in for you to think of an episode of New York. I like it. You can stay in my room for free every day if you come to Norway. Really? That sounds nice. No, freeze. You could come live with me. We could have like mod parties that nobody else is invited to. Oh, dude. Uh, that is like the easiest way to get ladies. If you if you go like deep into the mainland of America and have a British accent. Mainland of America. Oh, man. You are going to have a grand old time. I will to tell do you. What? Huh? Do what? You're going to have a grand old time. If you do what? If you go into the mainland of America. Because, like, you know, it's 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 even more common to have British people in, like, New York or something. Because, you know, it's like it's a coastal city. But if you're, like, in Kansas or something and you have a British accent, you'll bang the whole town. I mean, accents never really did for me. I've said that before. But, like, they just age better. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, I can Jason see that. Jason OTI is quite handsome. He's a handsome fella. Uh, I had a grand time in the States as a Brit. Yeah! Yeah, I know what you're talking about, Facington. My aunt, I think I said before, my aunt is visiting from Great Britain, and she was talking about how, like, oh, nobody in our family ages very well. Like, wow. you know, for compliments or whatever. And I was like, oh, no, I think you look good. She's like, no, trust me, you're not going to age very well. And I'm like, I'm not even technically related <laughs> to you. Technically, I'm, I'm fucking adopted. <laughs> And we were talking earlier about like, <clears throat> like skin color, and I'm like, um, she's like, we're all white, and I kind of like, as a joke, looked down at myself. She's like, oh, you're white, and I'm like, I don't think I am white. Yeah, but you I are think, I mean, basically white. White, white. I'm pale, but I'm not. Well, white. not even in that sense. You're like white in spirit. <laughs> oh my god, Starbucks. Please. I hate coffee. I just hate coffee. It grosses me the fuck out. I don't like coffee, although I am surprised that you hate coffee considering- Oh, fuck that! I'm- Considering- I'm, You drink only monster energy- energy forever. Cause it's sugary and s somewhat sweet. Like you can coffee. put sugar in coffee. It just tastes chalky to me! You probably just had shit coffee. You gotta come yeah, to New no, York and have some New York coffee. It. I can walk in a coffee shop and smell it, but it t smells like chalk. Yeah, see, you gotta get to New York coffee. Why the fuck is my internet so bad? It might be, it might be, like, uh, the reptile posse. Rob, as a non-British American New Yorker, I have to say I'm having quite the content time. 
Um, as a non-British American New Yorker, I have to say, but was, yeah, no, I mean, it's not like hard. You have to I'm just that saying. I, well, I, I didn't really understand completely. I just tell ladies I'm a mod alpaca I patrol channel. I don't know how to read. Free says I just tell ladies I'm a mod alpaca patrols channel, and they swoon clearly. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds very droll of you, Freeze. How um, droll? I'm, how is it in foggy I'm, old London town, Freeze? I'm from. Uh, I live in Minnesota. But I'm from South America. Yes. I'm adopted. So that's the that's the that's my life story. Jeez, we didn't ask for your life story, Maul. And then I killed a man in the sun. Oh <laughs> fuck you, Mr. Bloatman. Senor Bloatman. Oh damn it, I fucking lost my horror Pavilion. I'm such an idiot. Whatever. Can you please stop talking about America? It's kind of offensive. <laughs> uh, yeah. yeah. It's cool. I know. I think you told me that before, Cow's Fury, about being from Minnesota. See, I think I said your name right, unlike Robert. No, you're saying it wrong. You said Spirey. Yeah, I say Cow Spirey. It's actually K.O. Spirey. Wait, K. A. Spiri, yeah, that's it. But I, I, I was still only say one when I was adopted. Uh, the all class, so I cannot speak Spanish. Oh, they didn't teach you Spanish at one years old. I couldn't even say my name. I didn't even wow. know my name. Must have been. How was I supposed to speak fluent Spanish as a one year old? I can see Meat Boys in fifteen minutes. Ah, uh, is it? Oh my God! Ah, uh, you're stop being racist, jeez. That's just the cricket? Wait, what's just the cricket? Peach yogurt is in 15 minutes. Peach yogurt? What's that? Ew. They have this thing when you're not looking, they talk about peach yogurt. Those fucking bastards. <laughs> having, having inside jokes without me. That was a victorious, uh, victorious run, friends. It's good. Al Poco Petrolero says, next year I'm going to Australia for half a year with my school. It's going to be so good. I'm really happy for you, dude, but everybody I know is leaving to go to Australia. Am I missing something here? Australia's a cool place. I once banged a girl from Australia. I know, you told everybody. <laughs> the one time you I had know, sex. Like... <laughs> yeah, yeah, the only time. <laughs> Did I ever tell you about the one and only time I had sex? Yes, several times, Robert. <laughs> ¿Cómo estás? Suponiendo tu llama, llama español. Why does llama mean what it means and then also means a llama? You are late to the party. Welcome, Atherton. It's been a long time since I was in Spanish. I, I can sort of read Spanish, but I can't really speak it. I can speak and read French. That's cool. Yeah. Uh, I'll be right back. Uh, All right. You'd be surprised how many inside jokes we have here without Robin's being. Yeah, yeah, that's that's fair. Rob and his sexual conquests. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> After Rob banged that girl from Australia, he woke up. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. Um, it's true. It's true. Everybody, spread that like wildfire. Anyway, we're gonna take a quick break. Uh, we're gonna run three minutes of ads, so thank you those of you who let the ads run. By ads run, I mean those of you let the ads run without ad blocker. does directly financially support the stream, uh, so, which is me, and Twitch, and Amazon, and all those wonderful people. So, thank you so much for letting those ads run. If it's your first time on the stream, feel free to follow the channel, know when we go live. Uh, we stream every Monday, Wednesday, and Fridays. Mondays and Wednesdays at 9pm Eastern Standard Time. Fridays at 6, which you're watching the Friday show right now. Um, and, uh, we're gonna take a quick break, and I, I think we might watch the Meat Boys stream. It's only 15 minutes long, so... Um, we'll see, but uh, we're just gonna run uh, three minutes of ads, so thank you again for, for watching them. There's gonna be no gameplay while the ads are running, so you don't have to worry about that. We shall return.